Maddie, you have made every part of life so much fun since the day we met. You are a never-ending ball of energy, and you keep me on my toes <laughs> with questions like, what are your top 10 rides at Disneyland? I'll go first. You may have already picked out the names of our next five cats, but the rest of our future isn't planned. I can't wait to explore the world with you, grow our family, and learn together even when you send me more podcasts than I can listen to in a year. I promise that in the same way our relationship will continue to grow over the years, I will grow as your partner. I've learned so much from you over the past five years, whether it's simple things like calling my parents more, <laughs> taking my vitamins, or more advanced ones like appreciating the things I take for granted, that having a plan is better than winging it, or that you can watch TV and work out at the same time. Julian, I've never really believed in soulmates, but there have been many times in the past five and a half years when I thought you could be mine. Like when I went on a business trip and you spent all day baking me a fancy layered cake for when I got home just because, or when I brought a stack of books on our first trip together because I was worried we'd run out of things to talk about, and when I got home I realized I hadn't opened a single one. Also, every time we come home late singing duets from Seussical the Musical, <laughs> the Sia Christmas album, or Bo Burnham. And lately it's been the little things. There was one positive about the pandemic. It was the amount of quality time we got to spend together. I know that I found the perfect person to spend my life with, and maybe even my soulmate. <laughs> I'm so thankful for you. We've moved cities, we've changed jobs, made new friends, picked up new hobbies, we've traveled the world, bought kittens on Craigslist, and became homeowners. We understand each other without having to explain ourselves. We can have a deep conversation about anything, we find joy and laughter in the small things, and every day is an adventure. to push you to be the best version of yourself while loving you every day for exactly who you are. I promise to be there for you in good times and bad and to show you every day how much you mean. I promise that this will be an equal partnership in every way. I promise to be your best friend and foo forever and I promise to love you always. I promise to always listen and ask questions, whether that's listening to how your day was or when you wake me up at 3 a.m. to tell me about your dream. I promise to always reassure you that everything will be okay, whether you're worried about a big presentation at work or whether you aren't sure if your outfit gives off the right vibe. I promise to always love you and to make sure you know that I love you. I can't wait to see what we accomplish together, but whatever it may be, I promise that when we stop and look back, we'll see how much fun we had doing it. Julian, with this ring, Julian, with this ring, I give you my promise. I give you my promise to honor you, to honor you, <laughs> to be faithful to you, to, you. to share my love and life with you, to share my love and life with you, and always, always, always. Maddie, with this ring, Maddie, with this ring, I give you my promise. I give you my promise to honor you, to honor you, be faithful to you, be faithful to you, to share my love and life with you, to share my love and life with you, in always, in always, always, always. Husband and wife, you may celebrate. <laughs>
Men, both you and Julian, are special individuals, but together you will be a united force for good in the world. Now a new adventure begins. I thank all of you for witnessing the special event today. I know that all of us will continue to support and give strength to Maggie and Julian. I'm counting on all of you to support this marriage. I want you to uh, raise your, your glass and toast.